fusion is the process that creates energy in all the stars, including our own sun. All the light that hits our Earth came from fusion as a process. Ever since physicists figured that out, we've been trying to build machines that can recreate that process on Earth. The dream for OpenStar is to build a fusion reactor that can produce abundant, clean energy that's not going to contribute to climate change, and that the abundance is going to change the way people live their lives. My name is Raj Matata. I am the founder and CEO of OpenStar Technologies, and we're on a quest to build a fusion reactor. I'm Rod Backock. I'm the chief engineer at Piho Robinson Research Institute. My role here is leading the team who design and build the machines for electric aircraft, fusion systems, for sensing and extreme environments. Robinson have quite a deep relationship with OpenStar. OpenStar wouldn't exist without Robinson Research Institute. That's where I completed my PhD. I and mean, the original founding team are entirely people that I noticed in my time at Robinson who I thought would be great for building a company with. To see so many of the students who have gone through us, both as undergraduates, as interns, as masters, as PhDs, and even staff move into a fast-growing sector where they're working at the cutting edge globally. It's huge pride for, for us and the university and the Hutt Valley. I studied electrical engineering at Victoria University and I did my master's at Robinson Research in 2019. I was working at Robinson Research where I met Ratu, our CEO. From there, he introduced me to the concept of OpenStar and then I moved after finishing my master's. We're basically running on the premise that we need to double, triple, quadruple the number of engineers who can work on these kinds of things. And so having that kind of advice, support and proximity to a world-class institution like Robinson allows us to upskill the people inside OpenStar as fast as possible. We have an ethos of immersing them in a commercial, mission-oriented environment where they're working on real global challenges and making direct contributions. Honestly, we kind of don't have a choice. Climate change makes getting carbon-free energy onto the grid extremely important. We can't afford to take too much time with this. Here at OpenStar, we're pursuing the levitated dipole reactor, and the thing that makes us excited about that isn't just the fact that we think it's going to be effective, cheap, stable, sustainable, uh, scalable, but also fast. The fact that we'll be able to develop this technology in a time frame where it might actually make a difference for the climate crisis, that is what gets me up in the morning.